Yeah, singa we uri keshin. Ah, i bes pila ngaku uli makona lo. Kota beku ngela zuzu. We maka ngali bes ngela lo as lo uli ma. Bes pung uli manje. Uta subsistence fami. Benga stu ube benga stu lisu uli lo wani le. Tole ngunga matri pakis kono ko matri pakis. So so agu figin dao. Ati lapa eri keshi ni kulo me fugo omkulu. Ngoba se stola ama peksa mane. Kades is kulo manji kona pa stole andret. Dance kona pa kona. Pivo dewa. So kulo me fugo omkulu ya kulu. Kwe loke sa se uli me makaya. Ngoba lolo wazi loko funda futi. Si ya funda kona. Loke stutuka kanyani kanyani. So you are highlighting what the lapa is the founda. Who change change and from local to local and besides the man, the car is open. So so we are here till now. No school. So the civil school local. But in Shaba, to keep an eye, the man car. In Shaba, in Shaba one. Yeah. And now in Shaba, we try to find out what is going on. Yeah. 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 Antlers in the house, we to have a bunch of them. We have to to have reserve. So now we are going reserve. So we are going to put the people in the house. We are going to put the people in the house. We are going to put the people in the house. We are going to put the people in the house. We are going to put the people in the house. Uh, have also to do with uh, nutrition, uh, proper nutrition for our citizens. And therefore, if you are going to address the issues of uh, nutrition and, uh, and hunger uh, within uh, Zimbabwe, the scheme that we are talking about, Bubil Fund, is a, a very relevant scheme because it, it, it first of all, addresses nutrition, it addresses hunger, and thirdly, it addresses issues of uh, uh, household income. Uh, I think if we, we are no longer looking just at SDG 2, but also at issues of poverty alleviation, uh, then the income that is accruing to the villagers uh, addresses uh, the issues issues of uh, household income and poverty alleviation at at, at household level, and not just at household lo level but also at village level okay. and community level. Yeah. yeah. So, but I was being told that uh, when they are being paid, they empty shed the shops in in Lubai. Which 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 could be true, because then. Uh, once people receive their money in order to lock value, they probably then buy their sugar in bulk, and also those things that uh, don't rot uh, in bulk, so that they lock value. Uh, of course, they are, they are, they are, it means that they are very literate now, uh, financially, because if they were to sit with that money in their pockets, we would otherwise say that they are not financially literate. Uh, Knowing that uh, our country uh, inflation is uh, is a problem, and uh, because they are they are doing what you're saying, emptying the shops in a way that is even with property because they are, yeah, they are even, buying so yeah, far. Yeah, that that is an indicator of uh, high financial literacy. So what that what this program has brought is not just uh, uh, ag uh, benefits in terms of agriculture, but also benefits in terms of financial literacy. Uh, it means that people can now send their children to, to good schools, not just the, the resettlement uh, uh, schools uh, that, that are just coming up and are, are building capacity, but they are now able to send their children to Chavez uh, and uh, other good schools within the province. And that is good for the country. Yeah, I'm going to ask you 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 to ask
Okay. 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 <laughs> Deficient of uh, mineral nutrition. Uh, so, what we did um, was to invest uh, in the agronomic practices and in the science because farming is a science and a business. It's the science which informs the business. So, uh, the first step we did was uh, to analyze the soil, the soil surveying, the soil sampling, the soil analysis. Uh, to inform uh, the crops that we wanted to establish there. Um, basically, under soil analysis, we're looking at the NPK, your nitrogen, your phosphorus, and your potassium, uh, which are critical uh, uh, nutrients uh, for all the crops uh, that we established. So, um, what we then did. Uh, was to address the soil yes, nutrition yes, yes, through a number of ways. Being desert colorized, we invested in regenerative agriculture first.